So, 600 peppers, part two. It's actually kind of funny, a friend of mine uh, pointed out to me that while I was claiming to put 600 peppers in the ground, actually I only had one row of about 150, and that's a really good point. So I decided to make part two, which is actually just the Monday following up yesterday, Sunday, of putting all these peppers in the ground. So since I've been out here, uh, I got this uh, second row right here put in, and the reason I'm only putting them up to this point uh, I've got some of the real tall ones like this, and I've got some that are still kind of short plants. And this big old tree right here, which is keeping me out of our current rain sprinkle shower, uh, is in the past kind of shades out, gives late afternoon sun. So I already know that these plants at the top of the garden aren't going to do so good. So I'm going to put my smaller peppers that are kind of struggling anyways up here and the better quality peppers down that way so that they get full sun. It is one of the good things about this place is there's really not a tree in sight other than this big guy right here. So with that said, um, again, using my drill with the auger blade and it works out perfectly. Uh, basically, you just drill a hole, walk down the row, come back, and whenever you put a plant in there, I usually just take my finger and do a half circle and all I'm doing is scooping dirt back on top. Uh, just to kind of show you, these are the plants that I put in yesterday and all the rain showers that we had all night as you can see is already like flattened out the dirt basically so uh it's really not a problem uh you don't have to disturb the roots or anything just stick them down in the hole and peppers are fairly resilient so um from here you're gonna see me planting peppers y'all so that's a wrap for tonight my drill batteries have died uh, at this point i've got about half of the fourth row and this top corner right up here to do so with that being said uh, it's looking pretty good out here half that row three full rows i would estimate uh, maybe there's 500 or so it's gonna get cold here the next couple nights and the few pepper plants I've got left are only about this tall. So I buttoned up the greenhouse so it'll get nice and hot in there the next couple days. Hopefully give those another week or so to get a jump start. Maybe they'll grow another inch or two, which would be perfect for transplanting then. In the meanwhile, if they don't end up taking off, then I'll be just fine with the, uh, say 500 of them. Anyways, guys, I'm Ashby with Ashby Farms. Thanks for watching my show, my channel. If uh, you like what you saw, please hit the like button and subscribe.